going to London. You say anything? I can't. I, I can't remember what she said. said. Is it going to London and are you starring in it? Who did that? Um, well, I think definitely the producers. I know they've looked into it, but I can't confirm anything. Um, and I don't know uh, if they'd like me to do it. I would gladly sort of hop over the pond for a while. Yeah, why not? Okay, right here, David. John Kirshner passed away in 2010. Uh, 2011, sorry. Yes, so he has not seen the show, but I'm sure he's watching it and very pleased with it. But his son produced the Tony Smith. Yes, yes Ricky Kirshner produced the Tony Smith. Over there, please. Jesse, you joked before the Tony that you and Kelly were going to stay and fight. There's obviously so much love there. There's so much love with Carol King. <laughs> what is it about the theater that creates these lasting, strong, wonderful relationships? Well, it's funny because you have to meet someone on the first day. And depending on your role, you have to be their wife or their husband or fall in love with them or their best friend. You know what I mean? I, I think in, in theater is a form to other sort of um, jobs that you have to form connections with people because you have to do very intimate things with people, um, you know, depending on the story you're depicting. So I think that's why you have to do it really fast. And then you experience something really special and then you have to leave each other. But because it's so intense, I think that's why those relationships last. Great. Thank you and congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Carol, have you heard anything new about your songs having seen them on stage? I didn't learn anything new about my songs, but I learned a lot of new things about myself from watching Jesse portray me. So it was elaborate. Yeah. <laughs> well, to see, at that age, I had no idea of who I was or what was good about me or what was not good about me. And, you know, I've so, sort of learned that over the years, but to see it with such clarity. And, you know, Jesse and I do talk about stuff a lot. We met a couple of times at rehearsal at a week early reading, but uh, Jesse found all this on her own, and what she portrays is so true. It's so true for me, and we, we were saying to each other that we've given each other a gift. Jesse says it's a gift to play me, and I, I, I think it's such a gift to see myself as the woman I was then and actually like myself. <laughs> Well, I mean, it, it's the honesty. It's the honesty. And I mean, you started with a different lyricist, but then you learned that what you, to me, my understanding, you learned what you had to say was important too. And to me, that's, it's, it's, it's always your thought, your emotion, your love, your joy that you put in your songs. I think that's why people relate to you. And that's why I love her. <laughs> And because that's what I felt. Miss King, thank you so much for joining us here. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Jesse. Congratulations. Yes. Thank you.